My biggest regret in life is letting you bruise me. My strongest fear is letting it happen again. The words you spoke echo throughout my body like the songs of lost souls through a graveyard. They're begging to escape my breaking body. They sing a song called, You Deserve This Pain. One green and yellow bruise lingers on my thigh. It hurts when I touch it. Much like every time you touch my body, blue imprints of your thumbs on my wrists. I remember that night, held down, crying out, no one came. Instead, empty screams and weeps for nobody to hear. My heart, the most broken part of all, is inside. The most broken part hides. Its shards cut my body from the inside out, a kind of shrapnel and razor blade sewn. Razor blades like the ones I use to cut my body once I go numb, numb like cold fingers on a winter's morning. Cat scratches and bite marks on my rib cage. My rib cage, which is broken but not bowing, like shards of a mirror broken by angry hands. Angry hands that are yours like drumsticks that keep beating and beating. Angry hands that break me, getting heavier and heavier. Angry hands that can tear my world apart and bruise me every time. Angry hands that can beat me like a drum, each beat my body bending. Angry hands that ruin me, twisting within, twisting within my own ruins. Angry hands that tear me to pieces, snapping. Each boom shows another green and yellow contusion left on my body, and I'm trying to remember who I was before, before all this bleeding, before all this pain, before my body would bruise whenever you touched me, before I started using light hands around you like feathers in fear that your heavy hands would break me apart, before you were my everything that I couldn't escape, but only paper shreds of me are littered on the floor from wall to door if only I were strong enough to pick them up.